Hello everybody and welcome back to Ace Combat 5, The Unsung War. In the last episode, we were able to throw back an invasion from the Yuktabanian military onto Osnian, uh, Osnian land, I guess, or Osnian federal uh, land. Uh, but we were able to throw them back. We also sank that uh, submarine carrier thing that was launching those like nuke missiles or whatever they were. Uh, also, we got to see the fact that, uh, yeah, our spaceship with the giant laser in it uh, that was set up in the previous mission uh, is in fact helping us and was able to uh, make, a, uh, make it surface, make that uh, enemy subsurface and allowed us to kill it. As well as knock out a few of the missiles, uh, but we still had a bit of a, a time uh, having to go up to altitude to get above the missile attack and then go back down to strike the ships. But either way, it was an interesting mission. So let's get into the next one. Handful of Hope. Since we thwarted their invasion... We haven't seen any major offensive operation by the enemy for several weeks. Almost like we're at peace again, eh, people? Anyway, let's start the briefing. Yuktobanian combat operations have been dormant since their failed large-scale invasion and the loss of their underwater carrier, Synfaxi. However, there is still concern over a possible infiltration by small-scale forces from the ground and the air. You will split into flights of two and carry out patrols in the area from Akerson Hill to the northern coastline. The airspace above the grain fields extending around Akerson is covered by our Ocean AA system. The system automatically fires missiles at any hostile aircraft it detects. Patrol the northern coastline of Akerson Hill, which is out of our AA system's range. Okay, so it'll be me and Edge. Okay, sounds good. I'm good with that. <clears throat> Let's also see what aircraft we got. Okay, yeah, we have unlocked this. Definitely should pick it up at some point. Okay, we did not unlock the next one for the Hornet, but we got something else after the Hornet. A Mir 2000. Interesting. As well as the Fulcrum, a MiG 29A. And the A10 Thunderbolt. Oh my god. I want this so much right now. Also called the Thunderbolt 2, this ground attack fighter is well equipped for its role. With a large Gatling gun and tough armor to withstand enemy fire. Special weapon is an advanced air-to-ground missile. Up to four advanced air-to-ground missiles can lock onto and be fired at different ground targets simultaneously. Ho ho ho. Game, you... you spoiled me. Um... Don't have a lot of money. I do want the Fighting Falcon, though. Definitely want the Fighting Falcon. So we'll be buying this. Since we only have 7,000 generic credits in our stocks right now, which means we don't have enough to buy anything else, so. I'll be taking the Falcon out. Let's start the mission, and then uh, Edge, I don't know what we're gonna put her in. I want the Fighting Falcon. Captain, please choose my plane. Okay, so we actually do need to buy multiples. So we need four and etc. if we want to have more in there. I, I think we already established that last time, but I could just be forgetting that. Uh, we'll take uh, the FA-18C. We'll put oh, them in. Am I going up in Captain? Uh, yeah, you go oh, up Captain, with the Phantoms. So, we're going up in this formation? 
Yeah, I'm good with that. Need to buy up a couple more advanced craft. Although the, the phantoms are cool, I don't think they're really... I think they're getting outclassed at this point. That stupid geezer base commander just won't give us a break, will he? He's relying on us, First Lieutenant Chopper. Hey, congratulations on your promotion, by the way. Wait, you're First Lieutenant? <laughs> That's weird. I don't feel any better. Hey, you two. What's your current position? 300 miles south of you. Roger. Damaged, but the damage is light. Transmitting aircraft. State your assignment and current status. Finally, a response. This is the Ocean Air Force transport plane Mother Goose One. We're flying to the neutral country of North. We have the transmitter set to minimum power. Please come in closer so we can hear. All right. Ah, I think this is you on our radar. Yes. We'd like you to guide us to a safe passage corridor through the AA defenses. We're on a top secret mission and are not transmitting a valid friendly ID signal to the ground-based automatic defense systems. As a result, a friendly surface-to-air missile was mistakenly fired at us. We narrowly avoided a direct hit, but our radar system was destroyed and we can't fly a safe path through the AA system. All right. Guide the transport plane through the AA system's radar coverage and take it to Akerson Hill. The transport is on a top secret mission, so its ID signal has not been registered in the AA system's database. As a result, if the transport is picked up by the AA system, it may be shot down by our own missile fire. The engagement zone of this ground-based AA system is displayed on your radar. Due to combat damage, the transport's radar system is inoperable and its maneuverability restricted. Well, I mean, it's a Guide transport, plane, so it stays it's gonna have pretty bad maneuverability anyways. Engagement zone. Okay. Uh, the Air Defense Command just received multiple radar hits on an enemy formation closing on your position. First bad guys we've seen crossing the pond for a while. Warning alarms are going off like mad, but we're the only ones near enough to intercept them in time. Hold on, baby. We're coming to your rescue. Understood. I'm counting on you two. All right. Please, can you see the transport craft? Affirmative. Roger. Keep your eyes on it. Okay, I've got him on my radar. Just like the intelligence said. The radio's picking up the enemy's voice. That's, that's, that's not a new thing. Beautiful as Thunderhead. Sweet as a rose, I tell you. Don't let up just because it's a transport plane. If we take out this guy, they won't just give us a medal. They'll build a statue in our honor. This cargo certainly worth that much. Is that the enemy speaking? What are yes. These guys talking about? They're talking about our transport plane. We need your escort. We're completely defenseless. Alright, we're moving through. This is turning out to be a weird little race against the enemy. Brother Goose One, any problems on your end? No problems. But we'd like to get out of this airspace ASAP. Alright, we're moving through. Please fly a course that avoids the AA system. We are. Not a lot of holes in this system. Okay, okay. Ooh, didn't mean to do that. Alright, hard rudder, hard rudder. Mother Goose One, push to radio frequency 136 megahertz. Roger, switching. Ocean Air Force fighter pilot, can you see us? Affirm. Roger, please show us the way. We are. My plane's damaged, so I can't put undue stress on the airframe. As much as you can, try to fly in a straight line for me. Doing what I can. The way this is set up, that kind of problem. Alright, we're getting through.
definitely would stop enemies from getting through this if they didn't know exactly what they were doing. Okay, we got a tight one coming up here. Hopefully as soon as we get past this, though, we'll be in the clear. No, it looks like there's going to be some act for this. Okay. Oh, this is getting tight. Okay. We're getting through. We're skirting around this kind of tight spot. Yeah, it doesn't really help that you can't see either. No, not particularly. Just, okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on. Threading the needle here, Tr Come on, transport. That's good. I appreciate it if you could minimize your turns. Well, you're gonna have to get used to it. I'm blind as a bat here. I'm relying on you to lead me to safety. We're doing the best we can right now. Warning. We have oil pressure problem on the right engine. I'll take the controls. You check the instruments for me. Look forward, take a deep breath. Stay calm. Okay. It was just oh, we're skirting that one on the right. All right, tight turn, tight turn. Thank goodness we have all of you with us. I think we're about through here. Everything's smooth on our end. We'll be out of the AA defense systems coverage shortly. Yeah, I think we are. Yeah, I think we're good. Yeah, this is we're through. One. We've successfully navigated through the AA system. Thank you. However, I'd like to ask for your continued escort. Enemy spotted on radar. Coming head on. Chopper team has arrived. Hey, kid. We're under your command now. Where they at? Focus one. We'll take care of him. Please separate at maximum speed. Please. I'm counting on you. Please, we need your cover. You're our only hope. All right, we got gotcha. you. I got no radar contact. Please keep your current vector. Roger. Roger. Damn it. Your speed's decreasing. What's the matter? Mechanical trouble. I'm losing thrust on engine one. Hey, I see escort fighters. Oh. I thought there were going to be any escorts. Actually, didn't know that this was a uh, that this was a thing. If I click on on the stick. Alright, F-14 A's. It's a miss, come on. Come on. Come on, little bastard. Ah, oh, damn it. Doing so well. One got right in behind him. Let's restart. Let's not say I have to restart from the beginning. I do. Oh, and we just have to keep going. Yep. He's relying on us, First Lieutenant Chopper. Hey, congratulations on your promotion, by the way. <laughs> That's weird. I don't feel any better. Hey, you two. 
What's your current position? 300 miles south of you. <sighs> Damaged, but the damage is light. Transmitting aircraft. State your assignment and current status. Okay, we're gonna skip through the cutscene. Guide the transport plane through the AA system's radar coverage and take it to Akerson. All right, let's try this again. We gotta knock out those enemy aircraft. Alright. Enemy. Alright. Transport plane's right behind us. Right in our six. Please, can you see the transport craft? Hey, firm. Roger. Keep your eyes on it. Okay. We'll guide him in by rudder. Just like the intelligence said. The radio's picking up the enemy's voice. These guys sound as beautiful as Thunderhead. Sweet as a rose, I tell you. Don't let up just because it's okay. What are these guys transporting? A spy or it's like one of our own spies or some sort of like weapon system? We should be able to make it this time. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna heck hook right here. Please fly a course that avoids the AA system. We are doing so. Mother Goose One, push to radio frequency 136 megahertz. Roger, switching. Okay. I never thought the skies over our own country could be so unfriendly. Don't know if we hooked right or left in the first time we went through here. Tight turn there, tight My turn. My damaged, so I can't put undue stress on the airframe. As much as you can, try to fly in a straight line for me. Affirmative. Oh, see an Air Force fighter pilot. Can you see us? Affirmative. Roger, please show us the way. You're doing so. Cut here. Come on. Smooth on our end. There we go. That's good. I appreciate it if you could minimize your turns. Doing the best we can. Thank goodness we have all of you with us. I'm blind as a bat here. I'm relying on you to lead me to safety. Yeah, we're doing so. Turn, turn, turn. Alright. Looks like the right what looks like hooking right was the correct thing to do. I should cut it down quite a bit. She one dispersed. This is Mother Goose One. All right. Navigated through the AA system. Thank you. However, no problem. I'd like to ask for your continued escort. Enemy spotted on radar. Coming head on. Chopper team has arrived. Hey, kid. We're under your command now. Mother Goose One. We'll take care of him. Please separate at maximum speed. Please, I'm counting on you. Alright. Mother Goose One, don't panic. We'll protect you no matter what. Additional enemy targets on radar. Okay, there's Archer. Mother Goose One, and Chopper. Please keep your current vector. Roger. Roger. Damn it. Your speed's decreasing. What's the 
Okay, where are they at? Mechanical trouble. I'm losing thrust on engine one. Special weapons are permitted. I see escort fighters. I thought there weren't gonna be any escorts. I can't where are they at? Close. The enemy planes are blocking my attack. Roger! Leave it to me! Where are they coming at us from? That's a hit. Come on, one more. Get out of this airspace as quickly as possible. It just won't stop. Where's the other one at? I'll take a look. You take the controls. Come on, come on. This is Baron One. Get him off me. Damn it, a missile. Come on. We can fly just as well as they can. Yes. Yes, sir. Fox two! Fox two! Chopper, Grim, cover me. Okay, I'm protecting this transport plane no matter what. Alright, that's come on. Do it. Hang in there. Come on! Come on! Got him! Mother Goose, Mother Goose. MiG 31's coming in. Another hit. Destroyed. Come on. Hell. These guys are good. Hey, you there? Got him! Shit, 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 shit. Attack, attack! Holy shit! We gotta get these windmills out of the way. I, I don't know if we'll make it, so I just want to thank you before we go. You'll be okay. Yes, you'll do fine. Okay, one missile per. Almost there. All right. Those pilots ought to recruit you. They're gonna be in for a pretty hard landing. Yeah, that is not good terrain to land in. Huge, but they're still a hard target from up here. 
Alright, here they go. Looks like their speed's good. Hurry up. I don't think the transport plane's gonna wait for us. This job's starting to wear me out a little. Alright, there they go. Hey kid, don't give yourself a headache aiming at every single one. Altitude 100 feet. Almost there, I think. Mother Goose 1, just keep going. That's a Looks like you're doing good. A fine place for a man. I think they're doing okay. The transport plane is ready for an Fly cover flight. Landing. That's a pretty good emergency landing, I'd say. I think they did all right. Mother yeah. Landing confirmed. Whew. Good landing. Are you all right, Mr. Cargo? Uh, yeah, I guess. That was a pretty smooth ride, actually. Mr. Cargo, I've got a question I'd like to ask you. What is it? The Bird of Peace. Did you really have to use that beautiful white bird for this war? Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I wanted to see your... Your bridge of peace span into outer space. I can say, who the hell is this? Thanks to the bird, we're on even terms now. I'm trying to get to North Point, because I believe we have a chance. To hold talks in neutral territory. Right. Communication is vital. So I can still believe in you, then. Who are you talking to, to Nagasai? I don't know who you're talking to. Squadron, we observed the emergency landing on our radar. Can you see us? You can leave the rest to us. We'll provide support until the transport plane's crew is rescued. Roger, 84 92nd. Take care of them for us. Sure thing. All right. Well, passed it off to a friendly squadron, so we're good. We've received a sitrep from Central Command. The crew on board the transport plane you encountered during your patrol has been rescued by the 8492nd Squadron. That is currently all the information we have. Alrighty then. So we knocked out two F-14As, four F-16Cs, and two MiG-31s, and five ground targets. Alright. After my article, The Four Wings of Sand Island, was published to wide acclaim, I grew bolder. Here was a profile view of the base commander, the emperor of this base. Don't. He's in a bad mood today. If he catches you, he'll have your head. What happened? Huh. The Ark Bird. Huh? The White Bird in outer space, with Yuktabania outclassing us in firepower. It was the President's one trump card in the peace negotiations. And now, it's fallen right out of our hands. So you're saying we don't know how long the war will drag on? The Ark Bird. A superweapon capable of attacking from space far beyond the reach of the enemy. Its power generator was destroyed by explosives planted inside a supply shipment launched from Earth. Once again, the balance of power had tipped toward Yuktabania. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, so... Hmm. Well, I guess that does... That does make it a lot harder on us, because we did have a space weapon, and now apparently we do. Well, I guess it's still there, it just probably can't fire the laser, because of, it won't be able to generate the power. Or who knows, maybe it is just destroyed. Either way, uh, thank you for joining me for this episode. It was a bit uh, slower than the other ones, but I kind of enjoyed it. Uh, so thank you for joining me for it. If you liked it, please leave a comment down below and so hit that like button. If you want to help support the channel, consider that subscribe button, as well as take a look at the description down below, where I have links to my Discord and my Patreon page.
I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.